So you've launched a course and it didn't really turn out how you had hoped. Or you're thinking about launching a course and you really want it to be successful. So how can you make it as successful as possible? Well, have you incorporated video modules? Today, I'm gonna to share with you three reasons why your course will be much more successful by incorporating video modules. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Just the Tips with Trina, where I help online entrepreneurs figure out a video content strategy that works for them and how it can grow their business. Like I said, today we're gonna to talk about three reasons why video modules in your online course will make it much more successful. So the first reason why you need video in your online course is because it builds trust. You wanna be able to build that trust with your student. This course isn't just a one-time thing with this student. You wanna be able to build a relationship and build a community around your course so that when you're ready to upsell them, they trust you and they're gonna be ready to buy from you again. The second reason video makes your course better is because it provides a different delivery of the message. Not everybody learns the same way. Some people are, are more visual learners and some people prefer more text learning. But you need to be able to think about that when creating your course. So by creating a video, you could transcribe that video into text for the text learners and you have the video for the multi-visual learners where they need images or audio to really get that content and understand it because the whole point in you creating a video is to be able to help your students and teach them something they didn't know before. And finally, reason number three that you need video in your online course is because having video in your online course creates a higher perceived value of your course. By having video, people are really going to be willing to pay much more for that course, and they're going to be more willing to buy your course with video over a course purely text-based. It's just having that video element to your course really makes your course specifically stand out against anybody else who's not creating video modules. So you're thinking, how am I gonna incorporate video into my course? I've already launched it or I've already planned it out, or maybe you haven't even started the process yet. But here are five tips that you can incorporate video into your course. The first tip that I have is keep your videos under five minutes. So if you have a long or a lot amount of content that you need to share, break it up into smaller videos. People have very short attention spans and by keeping them in shorter, uh, five minute videos, they'll be able to get the most out of that content. Another way that you can incorporate video into your course is interview an expert or interview somebody who you've helped by allowing students to see the actual process and what it looks like at the end, it will keep them much more motivated to complete the course and learn the content. Third, you could create tutorials on video. So use a screen sharing software to record what you're actually doing on your computer or use a slideshow to walk people through the process. It just really helps those students that learn better visually with audio, you know, the multimedia concept. Especially if you're trying to teach a process, it goes over much more smoothly and people can really take in the process quicker by seeing it being done as opposed to reading the steps. And finally, just introduce each module with you talking. This helps to really build a relationship with the student by seeing you and knowing who it is that's actually teaching them. They can get a better idea of who you are, your personality, and really connect with you and your brand just by you introducing each module by video. So pop into every module, let them know what they're gonna learn, and thank them for being there. Just a quick little one to two minute video in each module. If you're thinking about creating video content for your course or your business, or maybe starting a business YouTube channel, kind of like this one, make sure you download my ultimate guide to video content for beginners. I'll put it right up here. It's a 30 page workbook to really teach you the beginnings of video content and how you can create it. So make sure you grab that so you can get started today. I wanna know, do you have video in your course or are you thinking about creating video for your course? Let me know down in the comments below where you're at with creating a course. If you think video can help your course, if you don't think video is gonna fit, 
let's talk about video and courses down below. If you found this video helpful, make sure you share it by clicking any of the share buttons down below. Send it to your business friends so that they can also learn about video and course content. If you aren't subscribed to this channel, make sure you go ahead and click the subscribe button right here. And as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye.